Felicity from Get Your Rock Out here with Billy from Fuzzy. How are you doing today? I'm doing awesome. We had a great set. It's great to be here. Fantastic stuff. It's an amazing day for you. You know, we've definitely got the weather today, I think. <laughs> oh, man, we've got beautiful weather here in England and uh, had a great set. It's like been an awesome day. Fantastic stuff. And you were happy with the set. You were happy with the crowd. Um, very happy. Very happy. Yeah. Very happy. Yes. No, that's really good. I mean, you know, I know that quite a lot of people were really looking forward to seeing you guys. And yeah, we had. fantastic from here. <laughs> we had the best time up there. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. That's really good. You've spent so much time in the UK, though, lately. You're, so, you know, you're building up the fan base hugely. Um, and I think that you can really, really see that with every show that you're doing. Yeah, we've been, uh, we've, we, we actually call the UK our second home. We've been yeah. over here so much yeah. and, and building yeah. up, uh, you know, building the roots. And uh, it's always great to come here. Well, we, you know, we really quite like having you, so, so it yeah. works nicely for everybody. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think we last interviewed you on the April tour that you did over here. Oh, uh, um, okay. Yeah, um, and so give us a brief rundown of what you've been up to since then. Since then, you know, we uh, we had a bit of time off, so we're writing for a new record, so we, we actually got to hang with our families, do some writing, relaxing, and here we are again, doing it again, you know, uh, rocking out again and uh, doing a lot of touring. Brilliant. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I think you're quite near the beginning of another tour now. Yes. So you've got, got at least another couple of weeks on this one. Yeah, we got another week on this one. Uh, then we'll go home for two weeks. Okay, and nice. then we're going to do a North American tour with oh, Saxon. Oh, wow. Yeah, and then... That's uh, going to be a fantastic build. Uh, oh, we can't yeah. wait. It's going to be great. Yeah, I And we're going to, uh, after that, we'll go back to Australia uh, for a couple of weeks and then make a new record. So, so you're not really going to stop? <laughs> no. Brilliant. It must be really difficult fitting in everybody's schedules because, you know, everybody does so much else as well. Yeah. Um, I mean, has Fossey really got kind of got priority for everybody that's involved in it at the moment? It really has, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's been growing in priority and, and uh, you know, we've been really busy and I think we're going to be even more busy coming up. <laughs> How very exciting. Yes. And you only had an album out last year, you know, Sin and Bones was, is, is not long out at all. Yeah, um, it came out in uh, August of last yeah, year. Yeah. yeah. Um, and, you know, again, you've had a fantastic reaction from that, from everything I've seen. Uh, were you guys happy with everything that people are saying about it? Yes, we're very happy. We're, we're very happy with uh, the response. We're very happy with the record, and we only wanted to keep growing. Brilliant. Um, and so, yeah, the new album uh, you're writing already, is that taking the same kind of shape, or, uh, you know, what's, what's different, what's new? Um, it's taking the same kind of shape, but uh, we want to we try to do something different because there's, you know, obviously there's so many bands out there, so uh, we're just trying to do anything we can to, to, you know, keep our identity. Um, and what do you think the most important thing for, for a band is to carry on uh, to kind of together as long as you guys have been doing it and carry on making such good records? Uh, you know what, just, just having a passion for it and having a passion for the music and the band and the sound. And we are, of course, here at Bloodstock. Is there anybody else that you're hugely interested in seeing today? You know, today I missed him. I wanted to see Vivian Campbell in the Last in Line thing. He's oh. one of my favorite guitarists. Yeah. But, you know, I love all the guys in Anthrax yeah. and Slayer. And, you know, there's so many good bands here. It's hard. You know, they're all good, you know? So you're actually going to be able to get out there and have a bit of a look at them. Which oh, yeah. Is always nice. Oh, yeah. Not shooting off just as soon as you finish press. <laughs> yeah, right? So always, always. Go eat thing. and go watch some bands. Oh, wow. Shit, a nice relaxed evening then, man. Yeah. Exactly. Um, the Bloodstock is, is a massive, massive force for kind of promoting new and up and coming bands. Um, who would you have on your radar as kind of a band that's that's coming up at the moment that you would have as one of your ones to watch? Um, as me, I would say maybe a uh, Carnival from um, from Australia. Pretty awesome. I love them. Yeah. Uh, and one of my favorite UK bands is uh, Bullet from My Valentine. I know that they've been out for a bit, but yeah. I love those guys. They're one of my faves. Um, well, that would be an interesting collaboration indeed. <laughs> yes, yes, for sure. Yeah. I mean, you guys must get kind of tour offers flying in all the time. I mean, you've worked with some amazing, amazing artists all together. Do you try and keep the artists that you are touring with just as varied as possible? Um, yeah, we do. We, you know, these days we we take what we can get and we and we go for what we can go for and you know we just want to keep playing and, and keep building our following whether we play with Lawrence Welk or freaking Bullet from a Valentine or you know Train or whoever. <laughs> Definitely. No, it's, it's 
been great to see you and you know you've had some you've just been playing with some fantastic bands on every tour that you've done actually it's been, yes it's been nice. Yes, yeah, Soil, Drowning Pool, yeah. done yeah. festivals with uh, with Bullet and uh, Slayer and Anthrax. It's yeah. awesome. And you know, your music seems to fit into so many different categories and so many different audiences seem to like you. There's such a, you know, there is such a crossover with that. It's a fantastic thing for any band to achieve. Yeah, we're, uh, we like, we like, um, different genres of music. So we kind of, with our influences and in the writing and stuff like that, it all comes through. No, I think it's very, very obvious, um, and especially the fact that you know you can play this and then you can play a completely different festival to a completely different audience and still have such a good reaction. It, it makes for a good, diverse thing. <laughs> <laughs> and so the next few months is basically touring, touring, touring. Touring, touring, touring till uh, till uh, the end of December, I think. Oh, yeah. Um, and the new album, when do you have a kind of vague date earmarked for yourselves as to when you want to get it out? I think we're targeting April or May of 2014. Fantastic. Yeah. And that makes me think that we should then expect you back in the UK quite soon after that. We will be right back here. Fantastic. I mean, you obviously get a great reaction from UK audiences. Um, I mean, do you find do you, do you find that in every in every way the UK shows are some of some of the most intense you do? There, it's like I said, it's our second yeah. home. It's like our second home. So we always keep coming back, and we just keep building and building it, and. Uh, We'll be back ASAP. <laughs> well, it's been great to see it. It really, really has over the last few years. It's thank you so much. It's been great to be uh, here. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to have a chat. Thank you for having yeah, me. It's been an utter pleasure. I mean, I, you know, I have absolutely no doubt we will indeed see you very, very soon. Very soon. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you, honey.